Okay, so I had some comments on the video by Vents, uh, which is the amazing fix for Netflix and Amazon Prime, Disney Plus and so on with screen tearing. Uh, this Pi has had the screen tearing fix, but it hasn't had the Media Center fix uh, or the Chromium fix. So let's just try it because some people have said it works in terminal. Uh, so I haven't tried that yet. Oh, and just to show you, if I go up here, go to internet, you can see I've just got the ordinary Chromium web browser. I haven't got the media one. So let's paste that in, hit return. Yeah, it looks like exactly the same, same thing has happened. So reboot that. So let's go in and internet. Yeah, so it's as simple as that. Wow. So you don't need the SSH bit uh, that I worked through and did a tutorial on. Uh, obviously you can do it that way, but uh, it's not necessary. And let's click on this program again. Yeah, it's working fine. So even simpler, uh, very, very easy to do. Now the other thing I wanted to cover in this video, I've had a comment from Anonilus uh, about using the Cinnamon uh, desktop on Raspbian. I did have a look at Taskel of a way of uh, installing different distributions in Raspbian and I found that it didn't work on the few things that I tried. I can't remember if I did it in this one. Let's see if it's already installed. So it's already installed, so I just need to do sudo task cell. And did I install anything in this already? No, I didn't, it doesn't look like. So it must have been, I've got several versions of Raspbian on the go at the moment. So let's try, I'm just gonna read the note again. So let's click on that, space, and then okay. I'll just hit return. Okay, so now we type in sudo update dash alternatives dash dash config x session dash manager. And then we need to pick cinnamon. You can see there's various other things in there. Uh, so we press one and enter and that's done. It doesn't, I've done this several times just to double check. It doesn't show you that it's done, but it has done. So now I guess sudo reboot. Is it starting up differently? It is. Okay, so here we have it. Uh, thank you very much, Anonymous, for this tip. They did say in this tip uh, that the Wi-Fi configuration doesn't work after um, you have to you have to put in your Wi-Fi again. But uh, I'm on a wired connection, so that's obviously going to work all right for me. Let's see if the Chromium browser is still there and still working fine. The Media Edition. So let's go to Netflix, Netflix. Is it gonna be still logged in? Yeah, I'm still logged in, look. So I'm tempted to put Tiger King on, but you never know what's gonna come on on that. So let's go back for this same, same program. And it'll remember where I last got to. And let's have a full screen. Let's just get some of the bit of color in it. Yeah, still working without tearing and still working with Netflix. Excellent. Right, so let's just have a look around here. Let's change the background because uh, the background is a bit dull, isn't it? Uh, so, backgrounds. Quite like that one, quite like that one. But I think I'm going to go for something, see sunset. Oh, well, that looks nicer. Right, so. You can hover over the apps and they change and it shows you what's there on the right. I quite like that as a, as a quicker way of doing it without, I, I like it when you've got less clicks. So obviously these will be all the things that are in. Oh, so Imager, here we go. Whoa, it's come up big, isn't it? Yeah, so that that's up and running and yeah, it's just going to, so it's Debian, but it's using uh, the Cinnamon desktop, uh, which is what Linux Mint uses. And so, yeah, I like that. Very impressive. What the settings look like? Yeah, so it has various different bits that, it, that are its own, uh, and you can see the themes and things are, are different. 
So what have we got here? Icons. Mate. Controls. Not sure I want to change anything there. Mouse pointer. Desktop, what's this going to do? Oh, it just says cinnamon. So it doesn't give you any other options there. Windows borders. Yeah, so great tip uh, from Anonymous. Thanks very much for this. Uh, really pleased that the uh, the fix is still working for Netflix and the, uh, well, I haven't tried YouTube, but I'm sure that's working fine. Let's just go back into the internet and let's just try the tearing fix on YouTube. Yep, and it's not tearing, so that's great. Now also, if I go back in, so where's terminal on this OS? Uh, oh, I can do it this way, can I? Or oh, I could have also done uh, Control-Alt-T. So uh, let's just go into task cell and see what alternatives. Yeah, so we've got others we can, we can apply on here. Now, I don't know which ones of these work or if they all work, but uh, I'll have a look at that in a different video. But uh, yeah, thanks very much to Anolis and thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe.